What's up guys today's video is on the top 5 best microwaves. Through extensive research and testing, I've put together a list of options that will meet the needs of different types of buyers. So whether it's price, performance, or its particular use, we've got you covered. For more information, on the products, I've included links in the description box down below, which are updated for the best prices, like the video, comment, and don't forget to subscribe. Now let's get started. Starting at number 5, we have the Cuisinart CMW2001.2 cubic foot convection microwave oven. The technology for conventional baking and grilling in microwaves has been around since the early 2000s, but only in the last few years have component prices come down enough for widespread application in consumer-grade microwaves. Conventional microwaves use microwave radiation to cause water molecules in food to vibrate, creating friction and therefore heat. Microwaves with baking functionality also include high-power quartz halogen bulbs, which use infrared radiation to brown surfaces as in a conventional oven, as well as powerful fans to quickly move air around the chamber for convection and air frying. In our tests, the Cuisinart performed especially well for making popcorn, leaving very few unpopped kernels. For its size, the interior capacity is excellent, but it lost points for taking up a good bit of counter space due to the extruding fan on the back. From there, the results were adequate if not remarkable, except that it showed a conspicuous hot spot, with a one-inch burn in the middle, while the entire perimeter remained unmelted. Testers did not find the interface intuitive and noted that the exterior smudged easily and that the interior was difficult to clean. Moving on at number 4, we have the Toshiba EM131A5 CBS countertop microwave ovens. The Toshiba performed well across most of our tests but stumbled a bit when it came to evenly heating frozen macaroni and cheese. For basic microwave tasks, this microwave is a great value, popping fluffy popcorn with minimal leftover kernels. It also didn't seem to have any pronounced hot and cold spots in our marshmallow tests. This microwave also has a range of sensor cooking presets. The microwave prompts you to enter the weight and type of food and uses a small internal computer to calculate the settings. These sensors work by detecting the heat and humidity levels in the microwave to gauge how hot the food is, then automatically adjust, depending on the intended result, whether that be steaming vegetables, cooking rice, or melting butter. Having to break out a scale might seem like an annoying extra step, but if you want to avoid the risk of overcooking and don't want to check on your food at regular intervals for doneness, it's a foolproof tool. At number 3, we have the Panasonic oven. This Panasonic microwave would have been our best overall pick if it weren't so pricey. It cooked ridiculously evenly and was spacious enough that it could probably fit a turkey. It does particularly well with reheating leftovers and heating frozen foods, so if that's what you predominantly use your microwave for, this may be your top choice. At 1250 watts, it's definitely powerful, room temperature water reached 210 degrees after just 2 minutes. This model boasts, cyclonic inverter technology, which, according to Panasonic, means that it circulates heat in 3D waves that lead to quick, even cooking. Based on what we saw, we agree, and it won the frozen macaroni test in terms of evenness. This unit offers a variety of presets, including a keep warm setting, a delayed start, and a setting for reheating beverages, as well as a child lock, inverter turbo defrost, and a sensor, which we found particularly accurate when it came to frozen foods. This microwave is quite large, though, so it's not a good fit for dorms or small spaces. Stove, praising its ability to heat up leftovers, quickly make frozen burritos, and soften potatoes. At number 2, we have the Breville CombiWave 3 in 1 microwave. This microwave has all the bells and whistles, it's very high tech and futuristic. It's also exceptionally quiet, and it allows you to change the beeping noises that let you know your food is ready. Even the door closes smoothly and quietly. Better yet, this model offers an air fryer function, which eliminates the need for a whole separate appliance and gets your food much crispier than a regular microwave could a convection bake function, and a fast combi function, which combines convection baking, grilling, and microwaving to cook your food faster. These are just a few of the 19 presets. We noted some temperature inconsistency with the microwave function, but this machine's versatility means it can do the job of several appliances in one, 
which could make it worth the high price tag for some. We plan to do further testing on its more advanced features and will update the roundup with those results. And finally at number 1, we have the Commercial Chef CHM770W Counter Top Microwave Oven. At 701 watts, this microwave has a fairly low power consumption compared with most others on the list. This means it may take a little longer for your food to heat, but it also makes it uniquely suited for traveling. I need the lowest power unit available and don't care if it takes a few seconds longer to cook a meal, writes someone on Amazon who bought this for their camping trailer and runs it using a solar battery. Another reviewer likes that it doesn't have a digital display, which can really light up your sleeping space in a small RV. And a third who uses this microwave in their solar-powered van likes it so much that they found themselves using it more than their propane stove, praising its ability to heat up leftovers, quickly make frozen burritos, and soften potatoes. Thanks for watching and that's all for now, I hope to see you guys in the next video, till next time.